Christian, a successful night under the lights. What did you make of it? Yeah, really pleasing performance. Um, yeah, obviously clean sheet and, and two goals to go with that. Um, really pleasing and obviously it was not an easy game. Um, Bristol gave it a good fight and um, I thought in the first half we were excellent um, up until 40 minutes until they hit the bar and, and had a chance across me. I thought I thought we were excellent and some of the best football we've played this so far this season and um, gets the fans behind us and it was obviously rocking in, in, inside there tonight. So yeah. uh, really, really good night. Across the 90 minutes you've just kind of analysed the, the team's performance. What did you make of when you were called into action? Yeah, um, yeah, pleased. Um, saved just on the straight of half time, and, and then a save in the second half. Um, big moments, and I need to need to be making obviously those saves. Um, but no, pleased with my performance, and obviously pleased with the team's performance as well. The clean sheets are flowing at the moment, aren't they? And the defensive solidity. What's clicking? Um, I just think everyone's um, wanting to play. I think the com competition for places is really, really big here now. Um, Obviously, Cam's been in the team, and obviously it's unfortunate tonight that he's he's come off injured. But then it gives Dom a opportunity, who's obviously been training really well. So um, it's a really healthy environment, and um, that's obviously created by the manager and his coaching staff. And um, no, it's a it's a really good place to be at the minute, and we want to want to maintain that and um, making sure that we're doing the right things off the pitch and on the on the training ground um, because it obviously all comes into practice tonight. Talk about how dominant the first. 40 odd minutes was, and then, and of course, you make your save. How big did you think it was that you took that lead into half time after such a controlling first half? Yeah, I think uh, managers touched on it there. If, if we want to be a big team, and mm. um, I think big teams, top top Premier League teams, are probably 3 0 up at half time with that, with that quality they've got, and that's where we want to, want to get to. So, um, yeah, 1 0 was obviously good, but coming out and getting the second goal was, was important. and and making sure we, we won both halves. You were the furthest man away on the pitch, but what was your view of the two goals? Yeah, really good, obviously buzzing for Chappers and Ever again. Um, Chappers obviously on fine form with his goal scorer at the minute. Um, took it unbelievably well. Um, I thought it was great play, shifted it wide and we've got into the box. And yeah, um, Evo's was, was a nice strike. I think it was a deflection as well, which helped it on its way, but um, you've got to obviously be there in obviously right moments, right time, and it obviously sneaks in the bottom corner. And late on, it might have been 2 0 and in injury time, but you were still 45 yards from your goal, weren't you? Yeah, um, got involved there. Um, obviously, it looked to break quick, and um, I felt that Mark Reese was on his way to get the ball. So, um, it's something we've worked on in training, and um, something that the manager wants is, is me to cover because we're playing so high and we're suffocating teams in their, their half that um, I need to be there to back it up and, yeah, yeah obviously sweeping that, that role. And, and making sure I'm there to, to cover all bases, really. Is that a role that you like? Yeah, really enjoying it, yeah. Um, it's obviously added to my game, something I've not really done that much. Mm. Obviously, um, the way we play and the way we play high, and um, I need to make sure that I'm backing that up, like I just said, and yeah, really enjoying the challenge, and, and I feel I'm improving and I want to keep improving. We've just finished this one, but of course, just a few days before Sheffield Wednesday, and that is a big trip. What are your thoughts out of that? Yeah, looking forward to it. Um, it was a good fixture there last year. We were unlucky not to uh, not to come away with something, now, if mm. I remember rightly. And um, no, really looking forward to it. Obviously, it's going to be another great follow and harder fought. Um, yeah. yeah, more than two and a half thousand. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, it's obviously unbelievable numbers. Um, it's not a short trip either, so it's unbelievable the, the support that we get from everyone, and um, we're all really grateful of it. So um, no, looking forward to to seeing everyone there on Saturday.